I use i5 4440 processor with 8 gigs of RAM and a GPU of GTX 960 from ASUS. In an ideal case, my temperature is about 47 to 49 degrees Celsius, which is really bad and it's not good because only when you're gaming, it should be at this kind of temperature. Now, when I start any game, let's say if I start FIFA 16, I minimize it, you can see it down here the temperature. I'll just play the game and just watch what happens. Oh shit, it's synchronizing. Guys, it's just finished its job. I will click the play button and watch the magic of the temperature rising from 48 degrees Celsius to a pretty high about 70. For this processor, 72 is the maximum allowable temperature. After that, totally fucks off. I'll just minimize it. We'll just start playing. Let's see when it starts shutting down. The temperature will keep on rising. Yeah, it's reached 70. Within another one minute, the system will restart. The restart is guaranteed because at this this temperature is really bad and it's critical. Let's play for a moment. Let's maximize it. I use the Intel stock cooler which came with the processor. It's totally bad. I'll just open it and show you how small it is. And you can't play games with that stock cooler. Please buy another aftermarket cooler for gaming experience to be best. That's it. The temperature rises to 72 degrees and the system shuts down. And it will again restart. These kinds of issues particularly system restart issues happens when it's really overheated or when your RAM is under any defect better check do a diagnostics to relieve what's the fault okay guys thank you for watching the video I've ordered an aftermarket cooler from cool master i believe it will serve my issue now let's watch the stock cooler which came with the intel i'll just switch on the lights and i remove this cabinet box let's watch it let's keep it over How small it is, it's just a kind of worst cooler ever I've seen in my life. Better kick this off and put another good cooler. Thank you for watching the video. Once I bought the cooler, I'll show how to install it and see how the performance increases. I believe it will change a lot. Thank you guys.